Good evening, everybody. I only have two. Hi, Eduardo is connecting. Hi. Hi, Rosalba. Good night. How are you? Hi. Hi. Thank you. Sorry, dinner. <laughs> yes. Okay, and I say breakfast. Hi, Eduardo. Hi, teacher. Hi, good, good night. Yeah, because it's night. It's 9. It's 9 p.m. Hi, David. David. Yeah. Eduardo is there. Kelly. All right. How do you feel today? Uh, I'm fine. Fine. Okay. How is it going? How is it going? Uh, fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Remember that you can say fine, cool, perfect. All right. You can have different options. Hi, Carmina. Hello. Why are you? Night. Night. Fine. Thank you. And you? Did you eat bre uh, dinner? I don't know why I say breakfast. Did you eat dinner? <laughs> no, not yet. Not yet. So you eat dinner when you finish the class? Yes. Because I ate arroz con leche. And... You know, some people say arroz con leche in English, rice, rice pudding. Ah, ah rice pudding. Yeah, rice pudding. Okay. Hi, Mari. Yeah. Hi, teacher. Hi, Hello. Mavi. So you ate rice pudding and you are not hungry? Yes. Um, yes, I'm hungry. Oh, you are hungry, Mavi. All right. Yes. <laughs> and you, Eduardo, did you eat dinner? Um, yes, I did. It's raining. Excuse me. It's raining. Oh, it's raining there, Carmina. No. Uh, Perdón, voy a hablar en español. ¿En, alguna, ¿En algún lado de ustedes está lloviendo? Porque escucho como lluvia o mi audio está mal. I think it's Eduardo. Hi, Eduardo. Mm -hmm. ah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, okay. All right, we're going to begin today with our class. Uh, do, you have the, do you have the list that I sent? With the, yes. with, the, with the verbs? Yes, it was a, a very easy list. Okay. Uh, all right. Sorry, sorry. This is. Ta -da. Sorry. Okay. Here. Well, welcome to class number four. Very quickly, class number four. So, welcome to class number four. And today we're going to practice a little bit with the verbs. Do you remember this? Uh, this is the the fortune wheel. Mm -hmm. So what we're gonna do is here. Here we have some verbs. Uh, these verbs are very easy because these verbs are related to your everyday life. Okay. Because okay. drink, sleep. Ah, oh, my favorite, my favorite uh, action. Sleep, or for example, kiss. All right, etc. Now, uh, I will need some volunteers, and if I ha don't have volunteers, victims. <laughs> All right, so my first victim will be, okay, Carmina will be my, my first victim. I will, okay. okay, Carmina, but now I will spin the wheel, and when you say stop, I stop. Okay. Give me a second, okay. Stop. Okay. Oh my God, this is so difficult because it is in the... Huh? So you choose, Karina, believe or work? Work. Okay, work. Now, please, Carmina, tell me a sentence about you using mm -hmm. the verb work. Uh, I work in the airport. Excellent. Very good. I work in the airport. Perfect. Okay. Uh, Madi, you will be the next volunteer. All right. So I will spin the wheel. And when you say stop, I stop. Okay. 
Ah, very easy. All right, Maddie, for you will be drink. Okay. Mm, I love drink. I love to drink soda. Oh, you love to drink soda. Very good. Excellent, Maddie. Thank you very much. Hi, Santos. Good evening. Good night. Hi. Sorry. How are you? Good night. How are you? Fine. Yeah. Fine. Okay. I, I'm working. Oh, you are in the in the you are in your in your workplace. Yeah. But congratulations because you are very responsible. Okay. Thank you very much. And for that. You will participate too. All right. <laughs> okay. So I will spin the wheel. Okay. And when you say stop, I stop. Okay, Santos. Stop. Stop. Okay. Very good. Ooh, kiss. Okay. Tell me a sentence yeah. using the verb kiss. How do you say yo beso a mi mamá? I kiss my wife. Ah, okay, okay. Don't say I kiss my girlfriend. Okay, no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, I kiss my wife. Okay, nice, Santos. Thank you very much. Hi, Carmen. Hi. Good night. Good night. Sorry. Okay. Hi, sorry. Hey, Carmen, I will spin the wheel. Usted me diga, when you tell me stop, I stop. Okay. Stop. Stop? Okay. Ah, but we have work. I will repeat. Okay, so Carmen, when you tell me stop, I stop. Okay, so repeat after me. We're going to say good morning, Parker and just Grace. Oh my God. All right. So we say stop. Okay, so Carmen, bye. Hello, may I speak to me, Graham, please? Sorry, sorry. She's not in. Can I take a message? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. She's not in. Can I take a message? I listen interference. Well, I'm, I'm going to mute everybody. I'm going to mute everybody. Yes, yes, please. Okay. There, there is a little inter interference. Okay. So, let me see. We're going to continue. All right. Um, so, Carmen, please, when you participate, you can, I will give you permission to unmute your, your, your microphone. So, Carmen. Okay, Carmen, tell me a sentence with the verb um, sleep. Sorry, I will, okay. Sorry, Carmen, give me a second. Okay, Carmen, please tell me a sentence with the verb sleep. I wanna sleep right now. <laughs> me too, me too, okay. <laughs> Thank you, Carmen. Thank you very much. Okay, let me see. Uh, Eduardo, you will be my next victim. Okay, Eduardo. Sorry. Okay, Eduardo, when you tell me stop, I stop. Stop. Okay, oh, but drink, it's repeated. Well, I'm gonna spin again. Stop. Okay, call. Give me a, call. a sentence with the verb call. Yes. Uh, I call my parents. Okay, I call my parents. Okay, thank you very much. And let me see, one more volunteer. Sabdiel, are you there, Sabdiel? Yes. Okay, Sabdiel, I'm going to spin the wheel. And when you say stop, I stop. Okay. Stop. Okay, Sabdiel, for you the sentence it is um swim. The verb, I'm sorry, swim.
¿Qué significa swim? Perdón. Oh, swim is nadar. How do you say yo nado? I, I like swing. I like swimming. Oh, excellent. Very good. I like swimming. Perfect. Okay, very good. Okay. Now, um, for the next, for the next uh, practice, okay, we have the list of, we're going to practice in groups. Let me explain this. Here we have a list of verbs. Give me a second. Here we have a, a list of verbs, okay, that I sent to the WhatsApp group, all right? So for example, we have eat, drink, work, sleep, write, swim, drive, study, work, believe, and kiss. Oh, sorry, sorry, everybody. Work is uh, twice, so eliminate this. So um, we have some sentences here. We make a combination of this verb and this time expression, okay? For example, we say, I drink coffee and we use in the morning. I work every day. I sleep a lot of hours, we can say at night. I write a letter to my mother every morning, for example. So please, everybody, take a, take a picture. Take a picture of the, of the slide. Take a, take a picture of the slide. Okay. Okay, did you take the picture? Yes? Yes. Yes. You can unmute the, the microphone. Ah, nice, Laura. Thank you for showing me the, the thumb. Hi, Samuel. Hi. Hi, good evening. Good night, I'm sorry. Good night. Good night, good night. Hi, Mario. Good night. Mario. Good night, teacher. Hi, Mario. Good night. Okay. Hi. So, do you have any question? ¿Alguna pregunta de lo que vamos a hacer? No? Sí. We're going to make, vamos a hacer oraciones. We're going to make sentences. With the, with, the, with the verbs I showed you. Se los voy a mostrar otra vez, all right? But now you have your microphone uh, open. Okay. Sí. We're going to make sentences sí, with this. Yes? Teacher, the verb work is repeated, right? Yes, yes, it's repeated. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's repeated. Yes. Okay, okay. You can use any other verbs. Vamos a hacer oraciones de nosotros. I, 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 I. I eat. I drink. I work. I sleep. And I'm going to make a song. I write. I swim. Okay. And okay. we're going to make a combination with the time expression that is here. Um, ¿Alguna pregunta? ¿Qué significa alguna de estas? ¿No? ¿Everything is clear? Mm, yes. Every day, cada mañana, every morning, every afternoon, every night, en la mañana, in the morning, in the afternoon, at night. ¿Ok? So, we're gonna, we're gonna go to a small groups and we're gonna practice. ¿Es clear? Yes. So, I'm gonna okay. send you to the small groups. Um, maybe we're gonna make, let me see, seven groups. All right, so we're gonna go right now. I'm gonna give you maybe um, five minutes to practice. Vamos a hacer muchas oraciones. We're gonna make two, two many sentences as possible. All right, so bye bye, everybody. Join your room.
Sí, ya mismo. Oh, nice, Edgar. Share for sharing. Hello. Hi, for sharing the, the screen. Do you have any question? Sabdiel, Edgar, hey. or Oscar? No? Hacer, no, no. hacer oraciones. Solo oraciones, sí, oraciones. nada más. De nosotros. Uh -huh. I write, I swim. Y las podemos combinar. And we can make a combination with a time expression. Every day, every morning. Okay? Okay. All right. I will go. All right. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Abigail, are you there? Sí, por error me salí. Ah, ok, ya la moví a otro. I moved you to another group. Let me check. Ok. Vamos por... Hi, hi guys. Hi, teacher. Do you have a question? No. Yo nope. sí, solo eh, carta. Por ejemplo, yo, I write a little. Oh, my letter. Letter. Ah, okay. Letter. 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 Okay. Sí. Question, eh, Laura? No. Oh, ok, Mario. No. Remember, como ya estamos usando otros verbos, other verbs that are not verb to be, it's not possible to say, I am swim, for example. No, you have to say, I swim. It's clear? Ok. Ok. I swim. I cook, but it's not possible to say, I am, because if you say, you are saying, yo soy cocino, for example. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -huh. Teacher, Hi. Yes, Mario. So, so may I to say, uh, I like, I like, uh, I like to swim, or I like to swim. Oh, I like to swim. To swim or, in the pool or in the beach. Uh, mm, well, when you say in the beach, it's not possible, Mario, because the beach is la arena, the sand, and the sea, el mar. Oh. So you say mm -hmm. I swim in the sea. In the sea, that's right. See, sí, yes. Okay. All right. I okay. will leave. Bye bye. 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 Oh, sorry. Uh, do you have a question? No? Sorry. <laughs> yeah, the thing is that the thing is that when I change from room to room, automatically I mute everybody. So, but do you have a question? No? No. Questions, okay. We will continue. All right, we will continue if you don't have any question. And, all right, let's see. I don't see that. Now, what do you do? Here, I have six pictures and I have six professions or occupations. Now, the question, what do you do, is for investigating the profession or occupation a person has. For example, number one, from these options, what does she do? ¿Qué hace ella? What does she do? Picture number one. Salesperson. Salesperson. Yes. Salesperson. Yes. A salesperson. For example, when you go to demand, 
Health person over there. When you go to Mariedad de Genesis, there is a person over there, a salesperson, all right? When you go to Tara or any, any place. What is number two? What Chef. 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 Se oyen allí al fondo. Se oyen allí al fondo. Oh, okay. Really? Okay, thank you. <laughs> oh my God. All right. Eh, les voy a decir algo así rapidito en español. A mí no me gusta callar los micrófonos porque me gusta que tengan la libertad de, de participar. All right? Pero si usted siente que donde está hay mucho ruido, so you can mute your microphone. Ok? Pero no me gusta. Okay, no me gusta okay. Que, okay. Para que tengan el espacio de expresar. All right. Now, uh, number two. What does he do? Chef. 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 Number three. What does he do? Mechanic. 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 Yes. Okay. Uh, listen. Mechanic. 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 Very good. Mechanic. Mechanic. Yeah, mechanic. What about the next one? Carpenter. Carpenter. A carpenter. Very good. What about the next one? Number four. Reporter. Reporter. A reporter. And what about the last one? Dentist. 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 A dentist. Very good. A dentist. Now, eh, I will, como les voy a compartir un audio, hoy sí creo que los voy a tener que silenciar. So I'm going to mute everybody. Okay. I'm going to mute everybody. Yeah. And now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, I'm going to share with you a listening. Okay? So, uh, I will repeat the pronunciation for you from these uh, professions and occupations. This one is dentist. Dentist. This one is carpenter. Carpenter. This one is salesperson. Like this salesperson, como que se le puso un poquito rígido el rostro, salesperson. This one is mechanic. Mechanic is not correct. We will say mechanic. This one is reporter. Reporter. The T is going to be R, reporter. And the next one is chef. Okay. Now, um, in the next slide, we have a conversation, okay? This conversation it has maybe new vocabulary for you. So I will ask you on your notebooks, if you have a notebook, you can take notes de las palabras que no conozcan. You can take notes, for example, for example, this word, you can tell me, oh, teacher, I don't know the meaning of guide. Okay, so you write the word on the novel, guide. Or teacher, I don't know the meaning of part-time job. Part-time job. Okay, so you write it on your notebooks. I will play the, the conversation, the listening, now. Unit two, what do you do? Page nine, exercise four, conversation. Where do you work? Part A, listen and practice. Where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yeah, it's a great job. I really love it. And what do you do? Oh, I'm a student. I have a part-time job, too. Where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Okay, very good. Now, I will repeat the conversation, and please pay attention. Pay attention to the pronunciation of estudiante, hamburguesa. All right, pay attention to the pronunciation because a lot of people say students or hamburgers is not correct. 
Pay attention to the pronunciation. I will repeat. Unit 2. What do you do? Page 9, Exercise 4, Conversation. Where do you work? Part A. Listen and practice. Where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yeah, it's a great job. I really love it. And what do you do? Oh, I'm a student. I have a part-time job, too. Where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Hamburger. Okay. Now, everybody, do you have any question with vocabulary? Carmina? No? no. Oh, and, and, yes. Oh, Mavi. Hi. Uh, why? What is the meaning? Why? Why? Mm -hmm. Let me check. Why do we let me see ah guide this one mm -hmm. guide mm -hmm. yeah guide a guide. tour guide tour guide guide un guía turístico mm -hmm. okay yeah a tour guide another question with vocabulary carmina what's the meaning yes 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 cuando dice like peru era lo que dijo usted la vez pasada como Pero no entendí esto. No es me gusta Perú, sino que era, no sé qué. Exactly. Very good, Stanley. All right. In this one is, uh, like quiere decir, por ejemplo, Perú. Okay? Mm -hmm. example, you can say, oh, um, I like different places. Like, y ese like sirve para decir como, y empieza a dar ejemplo. All right, Stanley? Mm -hmm. Okay. Another word? No more words? No. Everything is clear? Okay, very good. Now, did you pay attention to the pronunciation? How do you pronounce estudiante? Student. 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 Ah, student. Yeah. Did you pay attention yeah. that, that the boy didn't say a student? The boy said student. 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 Spell hamburguesa. Hamburger. 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 Hamburguesa, you pronounce hamburguesa in English, hamburger. 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 Yes, very good. Hamburger. All right. Now we will continue. No questions? No, right? Okay, we'll continue. And let me check. Sorry, everybody, I don't, I don't see the, 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 con okay, here it is, here it is, here it is. All right, now we will practice these questions. All right, these are only four questions. They are very easy. But if you pay attention, these questions, these questions have auxiliary. Se parecen a las preguntas que vimos con verbo to be. They are similar to the questions that we studied with verb to be. But this time, they are questions with the auxiliary do. For example, eh, Carmina, ask me the first question, please. What do you do? Okay. I am a teacher. So you are investigating my profession. Oscar, ask me ask me question number two, please. Where do you work? Uh, can you repeat, Oscar, please? Where do you work? Excellent. Where do you work? I work at Inglés Corporativo. What about you, Oscar? Where do you work? Uh, I am, uh, I School in Germany. Uh, you work in Germany. Escuela Alemana. Ah, in the ger in German school. German wow. school. Wow, very good. Excellent. Okay. 
Maddie, where do you work? I don't have a job right now ah, because okay. COVID. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes, it's really terrible. Okay, let me see. Paola, ask me question number three, please. Where do you live? I live in San Salvador, Paola. Thank you very much. Juliana, ask me question number four, please. What do you eat in the morning? I eat 10 pupusas, Juliana. Oh my God. No, it's not true. <laughs> I only eat two pupusas, two pupusas. All right, very good. Now, if you pay attention, all the questions have an auxiliary, okay? So we're gonna practice these questions. Oh, I'm sorry, uh, please take a picture. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, you have to take a picture. Or a screenshot uh, to the to the questions. Well, a picture. Yeah, ready? Uh, no. No. Okay. Okay. Ready? Ready? Yes. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Solo son cuatro preguntitas. They are only four questions. Así que nos vamos a ir a practicar un poquito de tiempo. We're going to practice a little time, maybe three minutes, okay? But I need okay. you to memorize these questions because these questions are very essential and important. All right? So I will do the poems again. All right. Um... We will go three minutes, three minutes. We don't need to go a lot of time. Okay, bye-bye, everybody. Go to your rooms, Hi. please. Mm -hmm. Sí. Agrizal Group. El grupo Agrizal. Creo que así se dice, ¿verdad, teacher? Sorry. Grupo Agrizal. Uh, well, eh, como es un nombre propio, because it is a proper name, you can say Grupo Agrizal, no problem. Ah, okay. Yes, but if you want to be more sophisticated, you can say Agrizal Corporation, maybe. Sí, así se llama, es Agrizal Corporativo. Ah, really? <laughs> en la Torre Futura. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What a shame. Está, yes, you are right. Estamos, no questions? Estamos cerquita. Okay, very, very close. Sí, a una cuadra, ¿verdad? Yes. Ajá. Yes. Okay, no questions, Laura okay. and Rosario? No. no, no. Okay, practice the questions. Thanks. Okay. Okay. Live. I live uh, in Soyapan. Okay. What do you eat in the morning?
Perfect, everybody. Were the questions difficult? No? No, teacher. No, quedamos a medias. I'm uh -huh. sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Believe me. Time, time flies. <laughs> time flies. Okay. We will now we will watch a video. Okay. We will watch a video. The video is uh, in the platform. But we're going to watch the video here. And I am sorry I didn't I didn't mute everybody. So you can pay attention. All right. And we're going to watch the video. Please if you want take notes from the most important things. Al final del video, at the end of the video, please, I need you to write or take a picture of the structure of the question, okay? I'm gonna play the video right now. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to understand and use Simple Present. Simple Present WH questions and statements. What do you do? I'm a student and I have a part-time job. Where do you work? I work at a restaurant. Where do you go to school? I go to the University of Texas. Where does Andrea work? She works at Thomas Cook Travel. What does she do? She's a guide. She takes people on tours. How does she like it? She loves it. I, you, work, take, study, Teach, do, go, have, he, she, works, takes, studies, teaches, does, goes, has. Now that you have watched the video, I'm sure you noticed the changes on the verbs when talking on third person singular. For example, we say, I, you work, he, she works. I, you take, he, she takes. This inflection happens only in third person singular affirmative sentences. Also, take note that when we ask any type of questions in simple present, as in this case we're using WH question words, we must use the auxiliary do for I, you, we, they, and does for he, she, it. When we put everything together, this is how the structure will look like. We have WH question word plus auxiliary plus the subject plus the verb in its base form plus complement plus question mark. Now what I want you to do is to type in a WH simple present question in our discussion box. Andrea work. She works at Tom. Okay. Um, I want you to pay attention to, give me a second. Okay. I want you to pay attention to these questions. These questions are information questions with a simple present. When we have information questions or double H questions in simple, donde dice statements es oraciones afirmativas, acá. Estas son preguntas, these are questions, and these are affirmative sentences. Now, if you pay attention here, we have some questions with the auxiliary do, and here we have some questions with the auxiliary does. Now, for example, what do you do? I am a student and I have a part-time job. Now, please pay attention to this and pay attention to this. When you have questions with the auxiliary do, okay, the answer is going to be el verbo en su forma base. When we have an auxiliary, the auxiliary do, the verb is going to be base form. Si usamos I, you, we, and they. But when you have a question with does, la respuesta que es una oración afirmativa, the answer that is an affirmative sentence, the verb is going to be with 
Okay? So, for example, where does Andrea work? She works at Thomas Cook Travel. Cook is cocinar, but also cook can be a last name, like Mejia, Lopez, Cook. It's a last name too. So here we have, uh, I will show you this. Mm, let me see. Okay, for example, here. Okay, this is very, very, very important. When you have auxiliary do, this is always in a combination with I, you, we, and they. Okay? No se les olvide eso, siempre. For example, when you have a question with what, where, do, is with this. And when you have a question with what, where, does, is with this. And the structure is. A double H, the auxiliary is do or does. The subject is any of these. The verb, no importa si es do or does or he, she, it, el verbo va a ir en forma normal en la pregunta, in the question. And complement, the C is a complement. Now, uh, I will give you permission so you can unmute yourself. Si tiene alguna pregunta, puede hacerla ahorita. Okay? Do you have any question? Pueden quitarle el mute al micrófono. You, you can. Do you have any question? No. Yes, Paola. Teacher. Paola, you have a question? Or who has Paola? No. No. Yes, teacher. Who has a question? Yo, yo yes. tengo una pregunta. Termina. Ah, ok. <laughs> Carmina y Laura. Ok, Carmina, you are the first. And Laura, number two. Ok, Carmina, ask me. Eh, teacher, when I do the question, hmm? eh, the verb is the, eh, in the base form. Yes, always. In, in every question. Yes, I will show you this. But, I'm sorry. Uh -huh. The verb change only in the answer. Excellent. But if the auxiliary is that. Yes. Perfect, Carmina. Yes. So, for example, you have, what do you do? Look at the verb. I, I go. Where does Andrea work? El verbo cambió. The verb changed. Because you have but, she, he, and it. Only in the only in the answer. In the answer. Only okay. in the answer. In the question, pay attention to the verb. Do, work, go, work, do, like, and no problem if it is do or does, but the verb is going to be the same. It's clear, Carmina? Yes, thank you. Perfect. Laura, you have a question too? Yes. When no. I use in or at? Ah, perfect. Perfect question. Okay. In is when you refer to a place in general in the hospital, in the restaurant, but when you mention the specific name, you say at. Uh, okay? okay? For example, for example, uh, teacher, where do you work? Oh, I work in a restaurant. Okay, teacher, where do you work? I work at Ola Beto's restaurant, for example. Uh, yeah, it's is a here? specific place. Yes, a very specific place. Okay, now I will, another person? Alguien más tiene alguna pregunta? No, sin pena, pueden preguntar, don't worry, you can ask me. Okay, uh, let me see, Abigail, are you there? Sí. Yes. Yes. <laughs> okay, Abigail. Uh, we're, you're going to help me. Me va a ayudar usted. You're going to help okay. me. Uh, ¿Pueden ver el punterito? Can you see the, the spotlight? Yes. 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 Se van a sentir como gatitos un ratito, right? Very good. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> now, Abigail, 
Uh, yo le voy a hacer una pregunta. I'm going to ask you a question. Y los demás sigan el puntito. ¿Ok? So you can see the structure of the question. Ok, Abigail. Where do you work? I work a cashier. Oh, oh, ok, puede inventar el lugar si quiere. All right. Tell me the name of a place. Ah, ok. Yes, I will repeat. Where do you work? I work a caja de crédito. Perfect, very good. Let me see. Carlos. Carlos? Yes. Hi, Carlos. Yes. Okay. Hi. Uh, Carlos, what yes. do you eat in the morning? Casi no entiendo esta parte, teacher. Porque... Ah, don't worry. Se, se acaba de unir. Mm, a la no. mitad me uní, a la mitad ah, iba, okay. pero... <coughs> Ok, don't worry. Eh, estamos construyendo preguntas de información, pero con el auxiliar do y el auxiliar das. Ok. So, right now, I am asking you the question that is like this. Si quieres, fíjese acá donde está el punterito. Sí. Ok. The question is, what do you eat in the morning? Que es lo que como yo en la mañana. Excellent, very good. Um, and sometimes pusas. Ah, okay, so you can tell me. I eat. I eat sometimes pupusa. Or I eat pupusa. Ajá, uh -huh, only that. I eat pupusas. Okay? Okay. Eh, okay. Eh, is it clear, Carlos? What? Is it clear? Está claro? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. Okay. Uh, let me see. Madi. <laughs> Hi, Madi. <laughs> Hello, teacher. Okay. Madi me va a ayudar ahora con una pregunta. Usted. Le voy a preguntar algo acerca de su mamá. I'm going to ask you something referred to your mom, okay? Using the auxiliary does. Mm -hmm. Maddie, what does your mother eat in the morning? Mm, my mom eats, it's, it's correct. Ah, yes. It's um, pupusas at morning. Okay. If you paid attention, si se fijaron, Maddie said, my mother eats. Yes, porque al verbo que lleve, das, en la pregunta, en la respuesta, we will need to include or add a letter S. Is it clear? Yeah. Everybody? Yes. Yeah? Yes, okay. Yes. 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 Yeah. So, eh, in the list that I gave you, vamos a hacer una pequeña práctica ahorita. We're going to do a little practice right now with this. Uh, sorry. Okay. Okay, bye. Here, for example, Bye. ¿cómo sería la tercera persona? How would be the third person singular for it? It's. It's. Le agregamos una S. It's. it's. Ok. Drink. Drinks. Drinks. Drink. Drink. Work. Works. 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 Sleep. 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 Right. Sleep. Right. Sleep. Right. Right. All right, very good. Swim. 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 Drive. 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 Study. 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 
Studies. Uh -huh. studies. studies. Work. 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 And I repeat it. Sorry. Believe. 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 Kiss. 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 Kiss.
Entonces vamos a trabajar. Oh, hi. Por ejemplo, yo le puse Carlos works every day. Excelente. La segunda es Paola eats pizza in the morning. La tercera es they sleep a lot of hours. José and José and Mario sleep a lot of, a lot of hours. Ah, ok. Uh, sorry, Edgar. Solo le puede, poner, le puede poner una nada más. You can say José sleeps. Ah, no importa si por, el, por el, la palabra que... Ah, no, no, no. Todas cámbialas a tercera persona. Las cambiamos como si fuese solo una persona. Exactly, exactly. Very good. Para practicar el verbo con S. To practice the verb with an S. O sea que aunque diga we love animals, solo decimos una persona. Ajá, uh -huh. yes, yeah, that's right. So, ok. Puede sleep a lot of Ajá. Uh, uh, sleeps. Uh, sleeps. Uh, hours. Samuel lives in, in a house. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Perfect. Uh, Joseph loves animals. Perfect. And um, Ernesto dance salsa. Oh, dances. Dances, sorry. Uh, Miguel. Okay. Aquí en el micrófono, teacher. Okay. All right. Uh, well, everybody, uh, we finished for today, but Vamos a tener varias cosas. Number one, you will have a little homework. Se los voy a mandar mañana al grupo. Pero tenemos Saturday and Sunday and Friday to, to do the homework. Okay? Number two, uh, yesterday I was going to give you today some adjectives for describing personality, but the time is short. So I will send you adjectives for describing personality. Les voy a mandar un video que yo voy a grabar de mí explicándole los adjetivos de personalidad al grupo, ¿ok? Ok. Y número tres, les voy a mandar algo importante. I'm going to send you something important relacionado a la pronunciación en inglés, related to the pronunciation in English. Eh, in Spanish, nosotros contamos sílabas en español por escritura. En inglés es por pronunciación, por eso chocolate es chocolate. Serían dos sílabas. Chocolate. 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 It's like Cho cho chocolate. 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 Yeah, it's like if you say chocolate. So, this is something extra, all right? That is going to help you for your classes. Okay? So this is the pronunciation. So everybody, wait this information for tomorrow. Y mañana les voy a estar mandando las observations. I will send you the observations tomorrow from your videos. Okay? Okay. Okay. So okay. If you uh, haven't, yeah. Okay. Teacher, uh, I need to have me uh, a group in WhatsApp, please. Uh, Okay, Carlita, uh, I will give you my number in the in in the chat room. Or, or no, Carlita, le voy a dar la información aquí rapidito uh, in Spanish. Uh, mandaron un correo con el link de esta de esta clase, ¿verdad? Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. Carlita. Sí. Yes. Va entonces en ese correo está un un link que la va a al grupo de WhatsApp. Ah, ok, ok. Ok, very good, yes. Ok, thank you very much everybody. You are wonderful students, all right? So, tomorrow I will send you the homework to the group and also I will send you the video. 
Oke. Okay. 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 Bye. 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 Bye.